Hi, this is Anil from Learning Lad and welcome to What's the Output video series on C programming language. Here we're gonna give you the C program and we're gonna ask you to guess the output of the program. Then uh, we're gonna run the program and explain the output. So all you need to do is you know pause this movie, take a look at the source code here and then uh, guess the output of this program. Once you have an answer, just play the movie and I'm gonna explain the output. All right, now I believe that you guys have an answer for this program. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do build and run. And the answer for this program is gonna be two. All right, now why are we gonna get the value of two? Here, while initializing this C variable, you know, we are using the unary minus operator. You guys can see here, we have a space between this minus and minus, and that's why C compiler is gonna treat it as the unary minus operator. Now, minus of minus two, you know, just like the math rule, it's gonna become plus two. And that's why we're gonna get the value of two and uh, you know it's not going to be considered as a decrement operator just because we have a space between them and if we don't have a space here now if i try to run this program we're going to get the compiler error that's because you can use the decrement operator only with the variables here this 2 is a constant it's not a variable and that's why we're going to get the error so i'm going to do build and run we're going to get the error and if you see this error it says l value required as decrement operand so uh, you can use this decrement operator only with the variables and here in this case you know when we have the space between the minuses you know just like the way that i have written here minus space minus 2 here this minus will be treated as the unary minus operator and the next thing is you know if i remove one minus symbol and if i save this and build and run this program you know you're gonna get the value of minus two so here you know this minus will be treated as the unary minus operator so this is it guys thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel check out my website learninglight.com for more video tutorials and i'll see you in the next tutorial